Hi guys! Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to teach you how to make your own uh, hand sanitizer without alcohol. Because I know a lot of people is asking me, there is no more alcohol out there. But don't worry, it's not the end of the world. We can do something that uh, we can help at least. It's not stronger uh, hand sanitizer with alcohol base, but at least it helps, right? To protect ourselves, especially for those... Uh, uh, germs or bacteria at least we can do something so today I'm going to teach you uh, using first we're using uh, hydrogen peroxide which is 3% with water distilled water if you don't have distilled water boil the water okay you boil the water at least 30 minutes and aloe vera gel if there is no aloe vera gel, I already show you guys how to make your own uh, fresh aloe vera gel, okay? Next one is tea tree oil with aloe vera gel and with water. And the third one is, um, I know, we know everybody knows vinegar is a good disinfectant, right? So what we're gonna do is we're going to use vinegar with uh, aloe vera gel and distilled water okay so first we're uh, we're going to do the hydrogen peroxide which is three percent with water okay first we're going to use uh, 100 distilled water or boiled water if you don't have distilled water you can use the distilled water so we're going to put 100 ml All right. Okay. Uh, this is 100 ml of distilled water, and then we're going to put uh, one teaspoon full or five ml of hydrogen peroxide. Here we go. And then. We're going to add aloe vera gel. Any aloe vera gel you can find in the store. Use aloe vera gel because aloe vera gel is good for the uh, chopped skin. So if because if we use hydrogen peroxide with water only, it's gonna be dry up our skin. So what we're gonna do is we're going to add the aloe vera gel. Okay, guys. Another one uh, teaspoonful or five ml of. Uh, mm. aloe vera gel okay here we go okay guys now okay mm. okay so now you have your own hand sanitizer with hydrogen peroxide with aloe vera gel so we know that hydrogen peroxide or some people it uh they you uh, they call it aguaxinada this is good for the wound healing right so this is also good at least to kill germs and bacteria so we can do something in us uh we can do something without alcohol but i would just want to remind you guys this is not uh, more effective than alcohol base at least we can do something that we can help ourselves even though we don't have alcohol but we can do something okay guys so my next video is i'm going to teach you the tea tree oil and water okay okay so now the next one is we're going to use <coughs> tea tree oil we know that tea tree oil is antiseptic we can use also this one as hand sanitizer actually guys but uh, I, as I've said, it's not strong as alcohol, but at least we can do something. But So what we need is 100 ml of distilled water or boiled water. You have boiled it for 30 minutes. And then we're going to add 30 drops of tea tree oil. 1, 2, Okay, so this is... Uh, 10, 10 drops of tea tree oil and then again we're going to add um, for this one we're going to add one 
tablespoon or 50 ml, 15 ml of aloe vera gel. Okay, guys, hold on. Sorry. So hard. So I'm gonna use this one. I'm going to open it. Okay, here we go. Oops. Okay, only we need 15 ml of aloe vera gel. Mm. Okay, guys. This one. Now, some of the people you don't like the smell of tea tree oil. If you want, you can add aloe uh, lavender. We can just add like five drops. Right? It, this is optional if you want because some of them, some of you don't want the smell of uh, tea tree oil. But this lavender also is antiseptic, so this is good for hand sanitizer. And then what we're gonna do is mix it, mix it, mix it, mix it. And now, guys, what we're gonna do, we're going to transfer this one in a bottle. Okay. Okay, there we go. And then, every time you use it, guys, you have to shake it. Okay. So now, you have your own hand sanitizer using tea tree oil okay now what we're gonna do put it here grab it okay guys so now and a, a lot of you also asking me how if we don't have uh, tea tree oil in the house okay what the third one is this is the last the last options that we can do okay we're going to use vinegar. What we're gonna do is we need vinegar. We know a lot of us were using vinegar in our household. But guys, we can use it also this one as a hand sanitizer. What we're gonna do is we're going to put uh, one uh, 50 ml. Okay, 50 ml of of vinegar okay this is 50 ml guys and then we're going to add 50 ml of water so the, the ratio is 50 50 if you have 100 ml of water you put 100 uh, ml of vinegar because vinegar is so uh but you call this one it's very uh strong especially the smell so sorry Okay, here we go. Okay, so here we go. And then again, we're gonna add aloe vera gel. We need is one tablespoon or 15 ml of aloe vera gel. And I said before, if you don't have aloe vera gel, you can make your own aloe vera gel, fresh aloe vera gel. Just find to my YouTube channel how to make your own aloe vera gel. Okay. We need 50 ml or 1 tablespoon. Again. So we have to open it. Okay. We have to put that is a 50 ml of aloe vera gel. And now, a lot of you is you don't like the smell, right? Because it smells of vinegar, so strong. What we're gonna do is we're going to add. For me, I like eucalyptus oil. I will gonna add eucalyptus oil. It adds minty and also this is antiseptic also. I'm going to add 10 drops of eucalyptus oil. Guys, actually, this is optional. 
if you don't have uh, uh, if you don't have essential oil it's okay as long as we can protect ourselves right don't uh, don't uh, don't bother about the smell what is important the smell or your protect yourself right now this is ready you can put it now in your uh, what do you call this one sorry it's a mess and then shake it okay guys now you have your own hand sanitizer Hmm, smells so good. If you mix the eucalyptus and uh, vinegar, the smell of vinegar is not so strong anymore, but you can smell of the minty because of the eucalyptus. Okay, once again, guys, I just want to remind you, don't panic. We can do something, even though it's not strong as an alcohol, as uh, the sanitizer, but we can do something to protect ourselves, right? So, Please like and subscribe my YouTube channel for more videos and always no matter what we do we have to wash our hands before and after that is the very important as of now so all the things that I teach you guys it's not as strong as uh, the alcohol base or the, uh, the hand sanitizer at least we can do something right so please once again please like and subscribe my YouTube channel once again uh, have a wonderful days guys and don't panic we can do something okay bye